Today, smartphones feel like oxygen. You can't imagine life without one. But the very first attempt at a smartphone? It looked nothing like the devices in our pockets. In 1992, IBM engineers unveiled a chunky prototype called Simon Personal Communicator. It wasn't sleek, it wasn't tiny, but it was the first handheld device to truly blend phone calls with computing power. Released to the public in 1994, Simon combined a mobile phone, a PDA, and a pager into one brick-like gadget. It had a monochrome touchscreen, yes, in the early 90s, where you could tap icons with a stylus. It offered email, fax, a calendar, a contact book, even simple games. Think about that. Years before the word smartphone existed, you could already send a fax and schedule a meeting on your handheld. Of course, it had serious flaws. Battery life, barely an hour. Price, a whopping $1,100 at launch. And coverage was limited to certain US cities. Still, for the 50,000 people who bought one, it was a glimpse into the future. It wasn't until nearly a decade later that BlackBerry and Nokia refined the formula, and then Apple's iPhone in 2007 lit the fuse for the smartphone explosion. But the seed was planted by IBM Simon, the first real attempt to merge communication with computation in your hand. If you want more first-ever tech, stories like this, follow and comment first phone below.